This is Speak Black to Me, Dr. Muata Kairi, Kevin Washington. This is more than just a moment of protest. This issue is bigger than George Floyd. It is an abomination to the thousands of Africans that have died at the hands of the terroristic endeavors of white supremacists. Music by D-U-D-E Speak black to me Speak black to me A dynamic space Of black discourse Where we engage in the process of elevating And transforming The mind Speak Black to Me is a space where we come together to transform and transcend our given condition to be and to become a more powerful. Speak Black to Me, the liberated zone of intellect, of insight and inspiration. It's called Speak Black to Me. This is bigger than George Floyd. See, the population that is out here now that is engaging in protest are, are those same people that watched a president, Barack Obama, spend eight years in office being dehumanized and marginalized. They saw this for four plus four years where many of them were in elementary school, some in middle school, and others in high school, and they watched how a society emasculated this man for eight years. This is more than just simply about George Floyd. See, this group that's out in the streets right now, the younger population, have witnessed something that no other population has ever witnessed. They have seen someone rise to the so-called highest seat in this land. They have watched them not be able to make critical decisions, being called a liar. They have watched this same person have his family attacked day in and day out. They have seen him go through the process of having his birthing right question. See, they have watched something here that none of us prior to this population have ever seen. This is what this moment is about. See, they watched Trayvon Martin. They've seen and heard about Sandra Bland. It's been videotaped for years of Lando Castile, Eric Garner, Michael Brown. See, this is not just about George Floyd. The timeline tells a bigger story. They've watched Ahmaud Arbery being shot after being corralled into a space. See, this is not just about George Floyd. This issue is about years of human denigration, benign neglect, denial of humanity, perpetually being put on the periphery, placed into the margins of society. This is bigger than George Floyd and those who desire to reduce it to such miss the magnitude of this moment. This is not just about a man, a black man who had his life taken by a white police officer. That's just simply metaphor. See, the I can't breathe this situation is the one that this population has experienced for years of not being able to breathe and now the cat is out of the bag. There are those who find it simplistic to just simply suggest that it's about individuals being angry. 
about George Floyd and no justice. Some would submit that it's about Black Lives Matter when it's bigger than that. This moment is a pivotal moment in history because this population of people of African descent in this country are demanding to be seen as human beings. But they're not questioning. Are they human? They're not even asking to be recognized. They are demanding and standing up and making a critical decision. And when I suggest then they, I'm saying they are us and us are me. Therefore, I am standing for something greater than just simply George Floyd, Michael Brown, Trayvon Martin, for these are horrific events in history. They had great tragedies because they were somebody's father, son, brother, friend, uncle, nephew, they were humans. And the fact that one could find these individuals to not be human and to simply deny them of the right to breathe is what this moment is about. We will not have our breath taken anymore. COVID-19 is a real critical issue because it takes the breath away. But racism and oppression and human denigration are even more suffocating than COVID-19 because it continues generation after generation after generation after generation. It has not changed. It is unremitting. And this is what this moment is about. Oh yes, this is a standoff moment. But it's not just about George Floyd. For George Floyd is metaphor. This is about being denied no more. Speak black to me.